Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I do unboxings here, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, and even a dash of Disney. So if you like unboxings, please consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. And if you're already subscribed, thank you again so much for being here. Today I've got a little bonus video for you, so if you have been subscribed for a while, you know that I do my best to post every single day at 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time as long as I have boxes available to share with you. And then sometimes those unboxings might just be a little bit quick because there might not be a lot of items or it might just be like a review of a different product that I've seen somewhere else on the internet and not necessarily a subscription box. In that case, I try to bring you a little extra content, a little bonus video later in the afternoon at 4. So today I have another jewelry subscription. It is a subscription and it is new to the channel, but it only includes two pieces. So I decided this would be a good subscription to share as sort of a bonus video with you whenever I get it. That's subscription is Pura Vida Jewelry and you're probably familiar with Pura Vida because they have been around for a while. They usually do corded bracelets with little charms but they have been branching out into all kinds of other things and they have actually started a couple of subscriptions. They have not just the one for those different bracelet sets that they are known for but also they have a jewelry subscription now. So it is $19.99 per month. You get two pieces that are exclusive to that jewelry club and that does include your shipping so I have been kind of watching it over the last few months and every once in a while I'll see a collection I'm like well I don't know that I would necessarily use that and then finally for this month I did see the spoilers I did see the collection I was like this is the time I really like these pieces and I'm going to go ahead and subscribe so here it comes in this nice little little mailer super simple kind of pretty aqua color and I'm just going to open it up and see what we've got so for First, I've got the little jewelry bag that just has Puerto Vida written on it. And that's that whole kind of uh, lifestyle, a whole kind of concept that they have in Costa Rica. Although Puerto Vida, I believe, is based out of San Diego, so right here in my backyard, and it just does say their, their jewelry club. And then I've got this nice pamphlet. Now, in the past, when I've ordered things from Puerto Vida, I have gotten uh, like a sticker pack, so I'm wondering if that's what I get. So here in this image, you can just see the like corded bracelets that they usually do, which is just kind of not my style. I feel like it looks a little bit young. Um, not to say that I don't have some of those bracelets and they don't wear them, but I just don't wear them that often. So it does say founded in Costa Costa Rica each purchase helps provide full-time jobs for artisans worldwide so I do love any box any subscription that has a little bit of a cause going with it so it just gives us a little bit more about their story and since this is the first time I'm sharing this with you guys on the channel I'm gonna go ahead and read it so it says in the summer of 2010 founders Griffin and Paul took a trip to Costa Rica where they met Jorge and Joaquin two bracelet artisans who are working tire tirelessly to support their family and friends they then brought 400 handmade string bracelets back to San Diego selling out in a matter of days creating the brand now known as Puerto Vida bracelets that's awesome Puerto Vida means pure life in Spanish a motto to enjoy life's simple treasures our products are handcrafted by artisans around the world and are as unique as the person wearing it so I think that is nice in terms of this little pamphlet that they have created and then it has this little pocket here with a pineapple and again you guys know I love anything with pineapples so let's just see what we've got so I think this is a sticker, I'm guessing. It just says Puerto Vida with a little peace sign, so that's kind of cute. I have so many stickers, you guys. I have no idea what to do with them. And then I think this might be, it almost looks like a coaster, but it's not very thick. So it's just kind of like, it's not even really cardstock, but it would make a really cute coaster. That would be a really fun thing as a little bonus thing if they started including that. But I didn't really get like more of a, more of a sticker pack. So that's, that's okay, even though I do really like their stickers because they're always really fun and colorful so it just says yay you're part of the Puerto Vida jewelry club every month we'll send you a curated assortment of the most amazing jewelry all for just $19.95 for up to a $50 value these gorgeous pieces are only available to club members meaning they're so exclusive you can't even find them online and then it just tells us how to uh, share on social media which you guys know if you haven't already started following me over on Instagram I often do close-ups and flat lays of the different boxes and products that I get and and that's just Maui underscore Noel. So hopefully I'll see you over there on Instagram as well. So let me put all this stuff off to the side and let's get into the good stuff, which is the jewelry. So I think getting uh, two pieces of jewelry that are worth like $50 for $20 is pretty good. So it's actually kind of like three pieces this month. So it, they both came on a card and then with... Um, 
with some plastic around them. Now you don't do any customization really besides like you get to tell them your ring size, but you don't get to choose like the jewelry tone or anything. It's just set every, every month, whether it's gold or silver or rose gold. But this time it is rose gold and kind of an opal and it's a two part ring. So I'm going to show it to you up close and hopefully I can get it to focus before I put it on my finger. So there you can see there's kind of that teardrop shape opal and then it's got kind of that half circle of rhinestones so they just kind of nest along one another so i'm going to go ahead and see if i can take this off they made it pretty easy you can kind of hear them sorry it just tells us to um wear with care but i'm not really seeing any more information about the actual pieces which is a little bit of a shame i know they have it on their website and in their social media because i'm not exactly sure if it is indeed opal so let me see if i can just put the first ring on so I guess it just sort of depends. You could wear them separately. So here is the first one. Let me get that to focus. There we go. So there is that teardrop shape. And I just kind of did it with the point going down so that I could put this other little half circle on on top. But you could definitely have it pointing obviously in the opposite direction. So here it is together. And I love how thin the band is so that if your fingers do experience a little bit of swelling, they don't look super puffy with it. Um, I think that's a really pretty ring. So I'm actually gonna flip it around because I think I like it the other way with the point facing out. Let me know how you guys would wear it. So you could also just wear this little like, half circle as well. Or if you had another ring where it kind of like nestled with the stone fitting inside, that's definitely an option as well. But I thought this was really pretty. I don't wear a ton of rings, but I do like to see them, like to see them in my collection, in my little jewelry armoire. And like I said, this one is so dainty and super comfortable that I could see myself wearing it for long periods of time. So I do think this is really, really pretty, really, really nice piece. And then let's get to the other one, which is a pair of earrings, which I love. And you guys know that I like dangly earrings more so than studs. And these are dangly, but they're also just kind of a really unique design. So this was definitely a winner uh, set for me. So let me just show you. They're kind of like studs with a little element of threader to them. So let me just untangle them. So here we go. So the little post matches the ring with that teardrop shape and it's kind of got those like beautiful iridescent colors almost like moonstone or something so it's pretty much like a kind of a milky white that's going to pick up different colors and then it just has this fun chain that hangs from the front of the post all the way around the back so it kind of loops under your earlobe so i just think these are really neat i don't have any earrings like this i love that people are doing different designs where they're really incorporating the backing into the design um, taking advantage of that and making it part of of the creativity that goes into jewelry design so this is fun so you can just kind of see how it works right so it's just this long chain and it has the backing on the back so this is one where you're gonna never lose the back because it's attached to the actual earring and so the way they have it so that it's hanging it has the um it's actually in a teardrop shape where the point is going to be going up and then you just have to feel around on the back and get it to hang and so there we go i'm just going to spin that so it's pointing up so i know you guys probably can't see it i almost wish that it was like longer and a little more dramatic but i do love this style i just think it's kind of cool if you were someone who had multiple ear holes i think this would look really cool as one of the higher holes where it just has this little like dainty chain hanging down giving you a little bit of movement but i think this was a great set to start with i am very excited to continue with the Puerto Vida Jewelry Club and see what they've got in store. I have liked some of the other designs. I think last month's was like silver and it was like, um, they looked like cowrie shells, which I thought were really cool. They had some really fun ones around the holidays that were really sparkly. But I just thought, and even though I don't wear a ton of rose gold, I thought that this set was so beautiful and kind of different for me. I don't wear a lot of uh, jewelry with stones. I don't wear, like I said, a lot of rose gold. But look how pretty that ring is, you guys. I'm super stoked on it. Let me know what you you think about it and hopefully I will see you all very very soon in my next unboxing. Thanks for joining me for this little afternoon bonus video and hopefully I will see you very soon.